Hi all folks, this is Max from uh, GalaxyS2Root.com um, So I've got an uh, updated overview of Alliance ROM. Now this is in jelly bean format. I really like it. I really think this is one of the best ROMs out there right now. Uh, for those of you who want to experience the touch whiz overclocking, uh, the multi-window and uh, all that more. So um, you get all of the multi-window. It uh, enables all apps which is really nice. And this one, the back button, if you hold down it, it will actually force close any apps. Um, so you'll have to add multi-window. That's the multi-window toggle. That will get rid of the tag, um, the tab there. And uh, let me show you, uh, it does come with some nice uh, customizations, Alliance uh, custom settings. If you go here, um, you'll be able to change your lock screen uh, to S3 Ripple. Um, this is really nice get the nice ink effect in blue. Now you can even change this color which is really nice. Uh, let me see here. Let's change it to uh, yellow here. And now you should change the ink to uh, yellow. So that's really nice and also you do get uh, other uh, lock screens if you want to. That's the jelly bean. Uh, really nice. And also let's try Blackberry 10. Uh, How do you do this? There we go. <laughs> Blackberry 10. I don't really like that much. Uh, Optimus 4X. Try Optimus 4X here. And uh, that one's kind of cool. And also Acer here. Oops. There we go. Um, so that's working. Uh, but I really like the Jelly Bean one because I get a bunch of options. And uh, I really like this. It's, I think it runs faster. And also, lock screen torch. This is one of my favorite features from like other ROMs. Now you can just hold down the center button to enable flash, let go. Um, so that's great. Uh, and uh, also, let's go look at UI mods. You can change the clock if you want. Um, you know, status clock color, all of that. Uh, status bar options. Um, you can change the status bar um, colors and stuff. And also uh, for the toggles, you can change the uh, toggles. Now for multi view, make sure you go in here and enable toggle multi window mode. Um, when I first installed ROM, I couldn't see multi window and it took me a while to figure that out. And once you have that in the quick toggles, you can enable it. And also you can uh, move that up a little bit. So let's change the button orders here. Um, so you can do this and uh, make multi window easier to access. And let's actually put it way up here. Uh, I like it about fifth. Yes. That way, when I swipe down, I can simply go like this to enable and uh, disable uh, multi window. Um, so that's pretty much it. All of these uh, small UI customizations you can do. And uh, uh, actually, that's not it. Um, that's not all of it. Let me show you. Let me show you as tweaks app. This does come with. Uh, Sia kernel, Sia Dormanix kernel, uh, Dormanx kernel, and uh, um, S tweaks is force closing on me. It's okay, just run it again. There we go. And uh, you can overclock it up to 1.6 gigahertz. My recommendation is about 1.4 gigahertz. Um, that will be plenty. I can turn off a uh, multi window here. And I've got it at 1.4, that's what I recommend, but you can go all the way to 1.6 uh, if you want to. And, uh, um, you know, S tweaks, you can tweak the voltage and uh, also the GPU if you want. I don't really recommend it unless you play a lot of games. Uh, sound, BLN, um, Backlight Notification, Notifications, Cron Tasks, all of this stuff, Duo Boots, um, you can also do with this, um, this ROM. So I really like it, and also does come with Note 2 Gallery, I believe. And uh, actually, this is the it's a regular one. Um, and also, let's go take a look at uh, the camera. The camera is actually not the just the logo looks like a 4.2 camera, but this is a modded camera. Um, this actually has a higher bit rate for videos, and uh, get nice camera here. And also, you, I think you can use the volume button. Yeah, there you go. You can use the volume button to uh, take photos. And also, you can turn the sound off. I don't like the sound. Um, I think 
think it's here. Do, do, do. There we go. Turn it off. Now you can take uh, spy photos. Boom. Um, if you turn the sound all the way down and do it, it will uh, not make any sound. Oops, there we go. There you go. So you got the silent camera there. And also, I think the power button also works as a camera. No, never mind. Uh, also, video here. And uh, uh, let me see if it has slow mode. No, no. That's the video there. Um, so, video, you will get a higher bit rate. Um, so, higher quality uh, videos on your uh, videos. So, very nice ROM, overclocking, uh, multi window, and also a bunch of these toggles that you can customize. Uh, I think this is a very good ROM for those of you who are just starting out with custom ROMs or you want something very stable that's based off TouchWiz uh, that's not going to stray off too far from um, you know the stock ROMs and uh, let me show you the multi window here let's op open up a browser here and this is working well and I wish the one thing I wish is the back holding the back button will actually activate the multi window but with this ROM you'll have to do it using that not a huge deal and also you can move the tab if you want to uh, up and down and also hold down the back button if you want to kill uh, whatever app you're on I guess it's kind of useful so check it out for this week's ROM of the week Alliance Jelly Bean ROM um, comes with a bunch of uh, lock screens you know a bunch of UI customizations overclocking multi-window I think that this is a very good ROM, um, you know, to install on your Galaxy S2 GTI 9100. Uh, please do not flash on any other Galaxy S2s. Did I say Note 2? No, S2, S2, sorry. Getting confused, I have too many phones. Anyway, thanks you guys for watching this video. If you have a Galaxy S2, uh, as always, don't forget to sign up for my email list at galaxyS2.com. And also, if you're on YouTube, please hit that like button for me here. Subscribe button up there or down here and uh, I'll see you guys later and uh, have a great great week and uh, congratulations to uh, San Francisco 49ers yeah see y'all later stay high on Android